All right, I think I'm live. Yo, chicken guys, welcome to Creative Block. All right, firstly, sorry, I know I've been gone for two days. I've just been a bit busy with modeling stuff. <laughs> uh, but I'm back. I'm back. I'm going to be putting everything into my streaming, you know. <laughs> you know how it goes. Either way, back in Blender. Let's see. Where did we leave off last time? Mm -hmm. Oh, hang on, hang on. One second. I think I'm. Oh, my cat's making a racket. Alright, so. I think everything is good. Alrighty. Hey Candy, what's happening? Yeah, I checked. I did check the game. I just need to decide what I'm gonna do with my life. <laughs> Alrighty, so hmm. because I still I still have to finish Neo because I'm playing that. And I'm still doing my legacy challenge on The Sims, so one game at a time, man. One game at a time. Alrighty, so it looks like we were here. I just wanna, you know, like I had reflections on here. I just wanna like to make sure I turn those off because I don't want like the musical stream to lag while I render stuff, you know. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Let's see, let's see. I'm pretty sure. I also need to get some colors. Anyway, anyway, let's get this. Yeah, Blender is super laggy, I don't know why. Anyway. Alright, there we go. I'm pretty sure my Chrome has something to do with it because I have a bunch of tabs open. Ah, uh, see what else do I have open here? should to give me some room okay now I have made this smooth and let's see let's see if my rendering is gonna break anything <laughs> hmm. area lamp Emmy's turned off with the sun on ah okay <clears throat> I think it's okay. I think we need some more brightness. I think. Hmm. I feel pretty confused right now and. Oh, did I change? Ah, it looks like I changed some stuff. That's what happened here. You ready? Let's do this. I think that's okay. I might make it a little... Like, 
think about that much is okay. Look at that. Just to make sure. I'm not even sure if I have the thing set to smooth or not. <clears throat> In fact, the bevel modifier would have probably been a little better because I can <clears throat> adjust. <coughs> Alrighty. Hmm. I swear this light is super, super dull. Okay. Let's do this. Let's check this out now. <coughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, my throat is messed up. Okay, 2.5 is definitely way too bright. I'm also gonna grab my references, have my references open. One second. Uh, where did I save these damn references? Oh, I should just... Your ref is always easier. There we go. That makes my life easy. Sweet. So. Hmm. Actually, I don't think that's bad. I do want to undo this and then just use a bevel modifier instead, because I think that that's going to help. <clears throat> yeah, bevel. Wait. I s huh. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, I haven't opened this thing in a while. <laughs> I'm so confused. hell is going on here oh there we go now I can see what the hell's going on okay I think something like that <clears throat> all right I just need to get the colors right and then, <clears throat> then I think we're good. Hmm. So like I said, we are going to do, um, <clears throat> jeez, you know what? Let me have some water. Let me do that. <laughs> uh, yeah. So we are going to have. I feel like it's lit well enough. Mm, yeah, so, like I was saying, we are going to have two different types of lighting. So that's also pretty important. We just need to identify what sort of lighting we're going for. I think the color of the walls is good. Now, I did want to grab this wall and then <clears throat> smooth it, but 
I'm not sure how that's going to behave, so let's actually try that out. Hmm. Yeah, I see we have some issues over there. Alright. Well, anyway, it's fine, because we're going to have to add in some helper lights and stuff. So, uh, for now, I think we'll just not do that. <laughs> All right. We've got our door. Uh, I think I've, I've got just a bit of editing to do here. Hmm. And these desk colors. I'm really not sure if this is the actual <laughs> color. <clears throat> <coughs> yeah, so uh, next, what I want to do is these are shaded smooth, I believe. I mean, these are supposed. Actually, let's. Wrong thing. all of these guys smooth just to make sure and now what I'm going to do is I'm gonna hide this edge split I just because I want to see exactly what's happening the edge split oh, let's see <clears throat> like that color <laughs> <clears throat> we still have a long way to go though in like a rendered mode so I can see what the hell is going on with this color. Uh -uh. Definitely not a saturation problem. Ah. Uh. like this hardness is also like too low hmm now this color is bugging me check this out you see as a smooth surface it behaves a little differently it also needs reflection need to do now I think is give it some more saturation <clears throat> uh, as well as I'm gonna basically take this back to uh, like flat see how that behaves Mm. 
Okay, you know what? <clears throat> we'll do this. Okay, I need us at about 60. Should be fine. Alrighty. Let's give this a look again. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Probably need some more saturation on that door as well, I think. Right now it looks super pale, but it needs to be a bit darker. Actually, let me look at... Yeah, I see some classrooms have like a grey door. Uh, apparently that's pretty damn close. I actually want to just lower the... Hmm... Check this out. <clears throat> Gonna saturate a little more, bring it down just a bit in value. There we go. Let's check this out. I think that's looking okay. Now, as for like you know the, in general, what they do is they kind of make like a shine kind of thing happen uh we'll work on that <clears throat> yeah i think we're doing good uh we're definitely gonna need some helper lights and that's that's pretty important looking for some settings that I found a while back hmm has to be something here <clears throat> geez sorry guys my I have no idea what's up with my throat today <laughs> uh, okay Like, I know this was here somewhere. Where the hell is this thing? Oh, here we go. Okay, okay. I see. <clears throat> Alrighty. So let's see if we can actually do this. Uh Okay, here we go. And now we'll take this wall light thing <laughs> and uh, now I wonder if I can actually get this to behave the way that I want it to. So if I use this, 
right? I'm not sure. Okay, let's look at this. Ah, oh. so if I disable, hang on, disable the sun. <clears throat> All right, those are getting lit the way we want them to but okay so we need this as well as the sun so i'm going to put these that guy and this dude where is this sun lamp <clears throat> into the same group There we go. So now those are in the same group. <clears throat> but... Hmm. I'm so... Okay, hang on. Let me just test this out. So... I want to see this. It'll still light everything. Hmm. I'm not liking what's happening here. I don't even know why this is happening. <laughs> uh, okay, no. Ah. Uh, how do I ungroup this, damn it? <clears throat> I think it's somewhere here. <clears throat> okay, so that's ungrouped. Now I just want to give this a look and see. And if I disable this guy, this is where we have to like really test stuff. Everything's still getting hit by. Ah, oh, confusing. I disable this and turn on this dude. <clears throat> yeah, then we just get the sunlight. Okay, which kind of makes sufficient sense, I think. I think. Now. I'm trying to figure out why. Hmm. Ah. We do have global illumination on, right? Everything is. <clears throat> everything is the way it should be. <clears throat> but the sun is so. Like. Ha! <laughs> this makes no sense. Oh wait, something changed with the color. Huh. Okay. Alright, alright, okay. <clears throat> so that makes some sense. Uh hmm. <clears throat> alright, alright, let's see. Be here. Actually, ended up adding two damn suns. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so basically, let me see if I have this right. We need both the sun and the lamp to hit the, the walls. That's what we need. Hmm. And then we still need the sun to hit everything else. Oh, damn it. <clears throat> uh, no, 
now we need to figure this out. Um, okay, let's see if I. Ah. Yeah, because we don't want the this plane to hit these, because we're gonna do something else for that. Uh... <clears throat> uh let's see, let's see. So uh... hmm. I'm so confused. Okay, you know what? Let's do this. We'll do this. Put them in a group. Okay. Now that they are in a group, right, let me see. Uh, where is that thing now? <coughs> uh, I forget where the... Jeez, man. <coughs> I'm really off form today, jeez. Ah, here we go. It could really be because of... <laughs> uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, let's just do that because... Hmm. Well, you see how it like kind of renders it funny. This is confusing. Okay, so if I say exclusive, check this now. Still doesn't light it. And I'm assuming. Check this guy. Uh, where did I find those groups? No. <clears throat> It's really difficult for me to focus in all honesty. <laughs> and that is because... Uh... See here. Really difficult for me to focus because... I have such a terrible pain in my knee. <laughs> really ridiculous. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> so now you can tell, okay. That we are lighting everything. Uh, so if I hit render, we should be getting some. Yeah. So we're getting light again. And that's good. Alright. So that's the sun and that makes sense. And now... I mean, heck, I could just use a Hemi, in all honesty. <clears throat> okay, so now... That does light it. Let me just do an extra render here without this, so I can see exactly what the hell is going on. <clears throat> hmm... <clears throat> so that's without the light. Yeah, so you see we still... And we don't want that. <clears throat> we basically want it such that the area lamp only affects the walls. So... Hmm. I could just put them into another group and then have that group light everything else. So we'll add this to group and we'll say... Uh, We'll just say everything. <laughs> so the everything group. 
Ah. Uh, is that what it did? to delete groups to be honest i think there should be like a section somewhere here in the thingy but anyway so there we go all right so let's see if we can do this mm. there we go <clears throat> i have to do this with everything that's a pain more water. Jeez, I have no idea what the hell is going on. Uh. What I am worried about, though, is... Does this have to do with every material? Ah, oh, no, okay. <clears throat> kind of does it by itself, okay. So this wall... Yeah, you do the wall light, okay. Uh, this thing doesn't have a material yet. <laughs> um, let's call this guy Teacher Disc. I'm not sure how efficient this is, in all honesty, but anyway. Hmm. You know what? I have an idea. I'm gonna take this cube. <clears throat> Alright. I just wanna see... Alright. So, because I've never really used light groups a lot. So, a random new material. <coughs> Alright, so if I use the wall light group, right? <coughs> and I say, yeah, yeah, okay. Wall light. So we know the wall light uses those two lamps. your best friend. Let's do it. <laughs> So let me see if I got this right. Ah. 
Okay, so exclusive. Okay, I, I figured that. So exclusive basically limits. Okay, never mind. Hang on. Uh, hey, communist, what's happening? What the hell did I do here? Can a mod argue with another mod? I maybe. Yeah. <clears throat> as long as it's not in my chat, that's fine. Okay, okay. I just want to make sure that I have this correct. Let's get rid of all of these because I wanna. Oh. Okay, so those don't have it anymore. All right, so. <clears throat> we have wall light. I'm good, I'm good. What's up? <clears throat> My throat is fucked, dude. I, I have no idea what the hell's going on. <clears throat> Alright, so. Uh, whatever lights are in the group will affect the material. So, I want to just test something. Alright. Go back in here. And remove the group for this guy. There we go. That's no, not part of the group. So now <clears throat> we know that this is part of that group. And ah, oh, where the hell is that thing? It's in material. Uh, if I say local, it doesn't do anything. If I say exclusive, because we need to be affected by both lights. Ah, this is this is another. Hmm. Unnerving and pretty damn confusing. Hmm. <clears throat> All right. is the perfect solution to this you know what we'll do this i think this is easier Oh, so is, is that like a bot that tells you how long I've been online for? If you want to know, it's been like 40 minutes, I guess. Um, you have bad throat because you need water. I'm drinking water, man. It's not helping me. <laughs> uh, 85 to 90 moles a day. Hmm. 90 moles an hour? Ah, well, I, I don't know. I don't know. Man. Okay, so... We now have two sun lamps. Let's go here and find one of them. Okay, one of them is in a group and the other isn't. Okay, that explains some stuff. Cool. Now let's see. So you see, we don't get a lot of the light, but that, that allows me to isolate this so that I can see exactly what to do here. I do feel like these aren't being lit enough. Just double check this. What the? Alright, go here. Yeah, there we go. There's the problem. We're now, we are now finding the problems. Okay. So this guy also has a bit of an issue, and that's that. And. The floor is fine, okay. 
There we go. That made our lives easier. <clears throat> you know, the color is still not perfect for me, but I feel like it still needs to be a little more saturated. But we still don't have enough light in the scene entirely, so. Alrighty. So now we can adjust the the area lamp that we have above there just to give us exactly what we need I do want to make sure that our what's our distance like oh jeez uh, doesn't even matter at this point uh. all right all right 25 I think I turned it to 50 doesn't I mean it will make it like slightly brighter but I don't think it's having a huge effect on what's happening here and so if I do this add another slot uh, make this guy 50 and then render that out let's see let's see yeah uptime is a command that's used for nightbot I got to go need to get some sleep. Alright man. Alright. Cool. Thanks for hanging out with me. Okay, now let's actually compare this. Okay, give it the lines. Alright. Mm. <coughs> yeah, so that's with a high distance. Distance of 50. Although it's really like. Yeah, it's really not affecting much aside from making the light brighter, which we can do by hand. So. Yeah. Mm, let's go back to 2. So I think 2 is fine. What I'm not liking, however, is how much light is actually coming against here, which we need to actually sort out. <clears throat> hmm. Uh. <clears throat> Let's see. I have another piece of reference here somewhere. I've also noticed people using, like... Oh. <clears throat> What's the word? Uh, I've noticed people using the, like a whiter type of wall. Now, I'm not sure how effective the area lamp is. Because <clears throat> <clears throat> I feel like, I feel like we could just use a Hemi. Like if we really wanted to, we could just use a Hemi. <clears throat> Uh, I do want to try something else though. Let's uh, firstly get this, get some more saturation in here. Still feel like it's not enough. <clears throat> Alright, so that's that. Maybe I actually just toughen this guy up a little bit more as well. Yeah. So. <clears throat> that's that. So now what I'm going to do is. Hmm. I'm going to try this. Here, maybe somewhere around the. I don't actually need this anywhere else other than the inside. Alright, 
<clears throat> Let's actually see where this distance is. So. Ah. Why can't they see the distance of this guy? Ah, oh, there we go. Get it such that it is. Yeah, I guess 25 was fine. Which is massive, but. <laughs> okay. Let's look at this. does definitely brighten up here I mean this thing doesn't have a material <clears throat> so that's our own problem we need to fix that hmm I don't like the specular highlight there hmm. now you see how it doesn't affect the walls and that's we have slightly more control over the scene <clears throat> but I'm still not happy with the overall. Hmm. Let's see, low light, high distance. I'm gonna disable this point light just for now. Okay. I'm gonna add another one of those. I'm just hoping that we actually are getting this light because you know what? Let's make sure of that. We need to just make sure that this thing, yeah, isn't actually part of the ceiling because then we aren't actually getting the light. We're just fooling ourselves. <laughs> All right. Jeez. Uh. All righty. Uh. So we don't want specular defuse only. Uh. I mean, like twenty five is good, really. I think. Yeah, even 20 is fine. And then we can actually see. Oops. Alrighty. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah, you see, I'm not too happy with that. And the fact that I want to adjust the... Actually, you know what? This also needs a color as well. Let's see here. Hmm. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> Maybe I'll... Hmm. I'm not actually sure. I feel like this thing needs to be desaturated, but darker. Ah, oh, damn it, man. Because <clears throat> there's definitely too much saturation happening there. So... Ah, don't worry, we're figuring this out as we go. So I think, you know, just for the sake of interest, let's... Uh... Now, I'm not actually sure... 
can I select? Oh, okay. So there's random ones. Oh, wow. Okay. Quite interesting. Ah. Huh. That's kind of funny because I actually only want a set of them. Ah. Huh. And I don't think this is an array, yeah. Because I actually just want like a little, just like, uh, oh, jeez. Like I want every tile. Hmm. All right, you're not for the sake of repetition. Let's let's not do that. We'll. If I can actually nail this brown color. <clears throat> I always need to use like a color picker or something. <clears throat> like deselect all of them. I, I don't I don't want to select them. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Uh we also need to engineer like oh whoops. We want to engineer like a texture. So that's another part of the whole thing. For now it's okay. Anyway, let's try and get the dark, the darkest of the colors. It definitely has more red in it. So. Purpley. Come on, damn it. I think somewhere around there. Now, <clears throat> here's where things get a bit crazy. And grab a cloud texture and uh, I don't think we want it hard or maybe maybe we do let's see if I could isolate this but anyway we have the preview here now we'll change the size on like ah oh, now this is the problem you see because Maybe tangent would be the best. I'm not sure. Uh, anyway. <clears throat> so we want this guy to be like... The... Anyway, we need color. Actually, we'll do that and we'll just make it gray. Like that could work, right? Uh. I'm not too sure. We'll see. So this is gonna go like somewhere here. Go into this guy. Actually, let's just turn freestyle off for now because it keeps trying to render lines and it's annoying. Okay. Hmm. You see, now this was the problem that, like, this is good, but that's the problem. <clears throat> Like, th this is brilliant. This looks exactly like what I'm looking at. <laughs> so that's amazing. Uh, hmm.
Now, the only issue is this problem. Because all of them have to be going in one direction. I've tried tangent. Hmm. And no. They all go in the same direction. I mean, this is the actual problem that I'm having. Global does the same thing. Generated is the only one that uh, I thought tangent would move tangent along the surface, but I was wrong. Generated is the one. It looks bloody perfect. Mm. But our actual issue comes in with the fact that like we actually have this problem that it'll go upwards. Uh, also need to adjust how the specularity behaves. Mm. I believe there's the, there is specularity, but where the hell is my mouse? Oh, okay, so here, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, definitely. It's a very light, very light specular power there, but okay. Let's go back to material. So, I mean, we, we have established the fact that... In fact, let's go to texture so we can see. Oh, never mind. Let's not go to texture. So now, that is damn good. But the issue comes in with the fact that this is what's selected. Ah. Why does this thing hate me? Okay, it's fine. So what we'll do is... Just use our face select. First, we'll go with all the ones that are going this way. Or, yeah, maybe just all the ones that are going up. Alright. Uh, this is the only way we're going to be able to do this. I usually like to do things that save time, but... Uh, this is a lot to do. Damn it, man. That's a problem. So make sure that nothing be selected. Yeah. Man, listening to QB makes me want to make music. I mean, I do make music, but like, it makes me feel like I want to. Yeah, this is really good. Alright, this is gonna take us forever. Feel free to like hit fast forward. <laughs> hit fast forward on the live stream. Uh yeah. I'm actually surprised we got this texture to work like. It looks exactly like what I'm working from. This is going to take forever. Should I actually, yeah, here we go. There we go. That. The. Jeez. I can just get out enough to see all of them at one time. Ah, uh, jeez. This is going to kill me. Now, the cool thing about using um, a cloud texture like this is that the UVs are actually different. Uh, especially on objects like this. So, depending on their actual space, the texture will tile that way. Because it won't always be the same. 
let's see. I mean, if we have to add some variation, we can. That's not a big deal, but having everything selected the way we need it selected is also part of the issue. <laughs> okay, here. Uh, I'll be happy when we're like halfway. Jeez. This is tedious. Damn it. Alrighty. We go in places now. Damn it. Okay. There we go. Uh, this couldn't be more tedious, to be honest. I didn't need to, like, map undo to, like, one of my mouse buttons. That always helps having... Especially undo, because it's a button that, like, you use all the time. And hitting, like, Control z Control shift z is a bit annoying. Okay. Hope you guys are enjoying watching me just make a selection. This is my life. <laughs> okay. Undo that guy. I might as well just sign this to them. Okay. song actually reminds me of Marion specifically because there's a song that sounds like a, at least a couple of his songs that sound very similar alrighty we're making progress now boys we haven't died yet it's pretty annoying that you have to do this like Blender needs to implement better selecting tools, I think. Uh, although, you know, I, it is because of because of the fact that I'm using a modifier. Um, well, not a modifier, an add-on to generate these. And it does its own kind of thing. Uh, yeah. So... Because of the modifier. Now, I am still thinking about using just like the Hemi, but I'm not sure just yet. The Hemi will allow us to just change like how dark or light the shadows are, and that's for as simple as that. But really how effective it is for us, I'm not sure. Uh, so that's all part of the testing. We need to test to see if the Hemi will do what we want it to. Or if we need to use um, like helper lights. Which we do actually need to use some to gain, uh, like I'll show you, to gain that like um, hot spot that generally shows in anime. Really, I think the the trick is getting texture involved as well, and that's where things start looking way better. Jeez. We almost at the end, thankfully. Jeez. I think. Oh, there's still a lot to go. I don't realize I could do this.
I'm just gonna select everything that's in my view. So I don't have to keep moving. Alrighty. We are getting places now. I should actually, I'm gonna link my art station because I am gonna be making a bunch of stuff. making a bunch of stuff because I'm actually working on a project so I'll have a lot of stuff to throw in my portfolio now hope there's not too much repetition but it's okay because it's easy to just like select random things I doubt it though although what I am worried about is the repetition like at a distance because from close you won't actually notice like, okay, you know, maybe there's a line that's going all the way. You won't notice that, but when it, it goes further away from you, the space gets shorter and shorter. You might be able to pick it out. Like I said, if we do, if that, if that does happen, we'll just mix. We have other instances anyway. I'm actually surprised that we nailed the color. Because I'm struggling with the color for the damn desks. And don't ask me how, because I have no idea. But I think what it is, is the fact that the hardness isn't as low. And when the hardness is low, it's sort of, it spreads specular light over the surface. So if your, specul if your specularity is white like this, it starts spreading white over it. And that's what causes the problem. So we might actually have to adjust the hardness. But anyway, here we go. We're almost done. Ugh. Come on, work with me. Come on, there we go. Alright. Almost done. There we go. Finally. Jeez. I wish I could. Can I actually select the inverse? I'm sure we can. Select inverse. Paint, mirror. Inverse. There we go. And that helps. So we'll take this one and we'll assign it to that. There we go. But now we can deselect in. Yeah. It's all perfect. Okay. Solid. So now let's actually go in and see. Because I'm really curious to see how this is going to behave. I feel like we have, I think we have grout. I need to actually make that like a dark brown. And given my reference, I feel like I should make it just a tiny bit thinner. Well, that's okay. Ah, okay. 
with freestyle. Prepare for lag, but let's see. Because I'm, I'm really curious to know right now what what the result's going to be. I'm really not sure why this is white like that. I need to just double check. But we did definitely nail the color. Which is damn good. I, like I said, I do feel like we need to just condense that a little bit more. For the most part, that's good. Hmm. Hey, Keller Bailey, what's happening? I I don't know. Are you the only one? <laughs> Let me check. Uh, I don't know. For some reason, my Twitch... I don't know. For some reason, my Twitch isn't updating the... Huh. In fact, let me let me refresh. Uh, tell you how many people there. Yeah, well, I guess it's just you. What's up? <laughs> I don't know why that why that blocked you there, but okay. Uh, hey, I'm good, man. I'm totally good. You see me working on my stuff. Yeah, man. Yeah, okay. Uh, I mean, with a tiny bit of color adjustment, I do st still feel we need to lower the size just a tiny, tiny bit. That'll fix it. Uh, how are you doing, Keller? Ah, it looks like we actually have some extras. Huh. That is wonky. And here these extras are. Really bad, man. What's happening? Oh my god, this isn't gonna be fun. Uh, hmm. Actually, you know what? I have an idea. We'll do this. We'll first deselect. We'll se no, deselect. Select these. And then. Do that. Bang. Okay. Now, there was a section here that I was kind of worried about. I'm really not sure. Like, somewhere here. I'm gonna make sure. But I see, like, all the stuff. Uh, let me see, let me see. Um, when I was really young, my mother died. Okay. Because some guy was drunk. Okay. Mm. Got him put into jail. And now he may be getting out three months early. Ah. Uh. Mm. You know, <laughs> now nah, I get you, I get you, man. You know, yeah, what can you do with like the, you know, the law, man. Uh, but really, you know what? There really is nothing you can do about it. I mean, it's pretty shit. Don't get me wrong. Like, that is really crap. Five years, if that's what he got, that's pretty terrible. And then still getting out three months early. Alright, so. Now, I do kind of know our settings here. Yeah, but you know, dude, every, everything happens. It happens. You know, you can't have control over everything in life. And, um... Maybe it's just a real test to see, like, you know... Who's, who's the better man? You, you you have to move on. That's that's how life works, you know? And so, sometimes you just have to accept... 
I mean, it's hard to accept when really terrible things happen or things like this that are unjust, but uh, you just have to keep moving forward. Uh, no matter what, move forward um, and be a better person because of your experience. I, I don't know what else to say to that. <laughs> but I know things things happen, man, and, and life can be a real bitch sometimes, but you just gotta be strong, man. Alright, so let's get into that texture. Do I have this hex code? Now, at least from my reference, it looks like one set of the tiles are slightly lighter than the others. I will actually work with that. It's not gonna be too difficult, but... Let's check this out. Alrighty. So for now, that's okay. And then... I believe we had the texture on a new texture and get those clouds going again. Uh, once again, hit it on hard. And then instead of, let's make sure that coordinates are generated. Mm -hmm. Instead of X, we'll use Y. And now let's actually give us a look. Prepare for lag. I think I have freestyle on. Ah. Uh, forgot to hit that multiply. With the help. Yeah, dude, you know what? I mean, in all honesty, there's nothing anyone can say that would make that would make anything right or make it better for you as a person. Um, which sucks, I know, it sucks terribly. But uh, you gotta be strong, man. That that's the main thing. Don't let it affect you. Um, you can be disappointed, you know, be disappointed because that's that's fine. But. Uh, um, don't let it affect you as a person. Don't let that change you, uh, or do or make you do anything stupid. Or uh, okay, that should be fine. And don't harbor, you know, anger. That's also not a good idea. It never really is. And I do feel that's still a. I feel they they're too thick. So I'm going to just go in there and uh, get drop this down. Maybe like 0.5. Just want to see how that ends up treating us. 0.5 might be way too much, actually. Yeah, that definitely feels like it's too much. Uh, I've had my fair share of tough times, dude, but you know what? You learn you learn from things and if you've, you've just gotta be a better person in life. Uh move forward. Be strong. Uh and you, you don't you don't need anyone to make you feel better and stuff, man. You You just learn from what's happened and Yeah, and just move forward. Uh, people always say I should be like a motivational speaker or some shit, but, <laughs> but I'm not too sure. <laughs> okay, now to break the monotony, we're gonna make these lighter, and let's so let's actually try that. I see we get some nice light, but it looks like once the uh, line sets in, it kind of fades fades off. Hmm. Which I'm not too happy about. And the fact that we're getting the specular highlights on this side. I mean, it should be on the sides. But anyway. Um, Humble Partner. Okay, I'm not sure if you've ever used Humble Bundle. But uh, you get games <laughs> from Humble Bundle. 
and uh yeah yeah you get games from humble bundle so i'm a partner if you'd like to support my channel or support my channel and support charity because humble bundle has charity um options you can basically buy a game or a bundle if you don't know what humble bundle is humble bundle basically has like monthly monthly they have like a couple of different bundles throughout the month so you get a bunch of games like in a bundle and you get to pay what you want for it and then if you want like they have extra games in the bundle you pay more so yeah you can support the channel and donate to charity at the same time and still get games which is pretty cool if you ask me um all right let's see this i want to hmm Yeah, I'm feeling like this is good, but what I do want to do is go in here instead of having this as multiply. Uh, I really don't know. Lighten? Is that a thing? No, that's not what I wanted. Uh, the opposite of multiply is screen. Is that it? Uh, do you have like something I can donate to you when I get money? Uh, not currently until I'm, uh, <clears throat> until I am, uh, affiliated. Uh, but if you want to support me, just buy, buy some games. At, le at least you can, uh, you know, you can do that. Uh, but, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Um, it's just because I'm waiting to get affiliated and then you can do the butts. It's really because PayPal doesn't... PayPal doesn't behave very well with my country. Uh, at least not behave. My country doesn't gel well with getting money from overseas. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, it's still way too, like... Yeah, you know, we'll leave it on multiply. We'll leave the mud gray. What we'll do is we'll just... Uh, come in here. That's looking good. The, even that color is pretty good, but... We can't actually use that, so... Let's go in there. Desaturate a little bit. Get some... Actually, I'm not sure if desaturating is the answer. I just need to make it lighter, right? Let's try that. I think that's terrible. <laughs> yeah, it's terrible. <laughs> yeah. We need to get the right color. So I do know is that it's pretty close to the original color that we had. This is, so now we'll be able to tell better. Oh. Uh, this is terrible. Mm. Now I'm really not sure about getting this color. You know, we'll get the color back. Damn it. color back yeah so that's it dude it's just i'm like one one average viewer short from getting affiliate uh, affiliated so yeah once i'm affiliated it's all good okay so now we have this i need to figure out how the hell we're gonna get the color lighter hmm Well, instead of making it lighter, maybe we could make it... Hmm. Maybe we could make it darker? Yeah. And I think the best way to make it darker is just make this darker.
Hmm. I'm not sure. Uh, can you give me a link to this? Uh, to the stream or to Humble Bundle? I'm not getting the color that I want. That's driving me insane. Hmm. Uh, Keller, I'm not sure if, if you wanted to link to the Humble Bundle or to my stream. <laughs> uh, we gotta make this darker, somehow. I'm not sure if value is the answer. Let's try. It's slightly too dark, but we close. close. I think it needs to be just slightly lighter. Because they've got to be pretty damn close in color. Holy shit. <laughs> Come on, that couldn't have changed it that much. Mm, can I actually... It's really difficult for me to see. Uh, I was sending the stream on my Discord. Oh, okay, thank you. Thank you so much. I hope you're digging the music as much as I am, because I'm freaking digging this music, man. Uh, come on. Still not dark enough. And then like this gets too dark. Like that's the issue here, man. Like there's a point where it just gets way too dark too quickly. You see, like I said, you'll you'll notice there is no repetition. Like they might be like somewhere, but because it extends over the entire thing. Ends up making it pretty cool. Uh, Alright, do you still need the link or... Oh, okay, you got it. Okay, cool. I see me. Okay. Yeah, there we go. That's the right color, I think. I might actually scrap the bevel. Well, I do actually like how that light... It's the floor. I just wish it was on the other damn side. I do feel like this line is, this one specifically is too thick. Mm. But I think when I, actually I'm going to freestyle and just check this. Uh, go to alpha, lower this guy a little more. Because I really shouldn't be controlling this this way, but for the sake of it, really. That makes it a little better. 
I need to adjust it such that the lines are thinner the further away things get. Which I think is a better option. There we go. That's looking pretty damn good. Um, now I should probably get the... Uh, how many followers did I need? Now I'm actually on the... F I've, I've already reached the follower goal. I need one more average viewer. So I need one person that shows up to most of my streams. For most of my streams. Uh, or usually when you have a lot, a lot of viewers... At, at one time it counts for like higher average viewers so yeah as long as I can nail one more average viewer this is actually pretty damn good now there needs to be some work here I really don't know if this is the answer in all honesty I feel like I should be using a hemi instead of this uh, aerial lamp <laughs> Thank you, man. Uh, that's looking pretty damn good, though. No jokes. Yeah, I still feel like the line is a bit too, too thick, but it's okay. Do I stream every day? Uh, look, I ditched two days. <laughs> I ditched... Uh, like yesterday and the day before. But I was just really tired. I was doing a bunch of modeling stuff and super, super busy with that stuff. So that's why. But I do generally stream every day, yes. I feel like we need to hit that value change here as well. I think apparently there's like wood in front, like a, a wooden section you know uh not so far so good i mean it's looking good we need to like you'll see these black shadows these are a huge problem and we need to remedy that and i'm not sure how we're going to remedy that i'm not sure if we still have Let's see where's our aerial lights it's this one Let's leave this at 50. I just wanna give this a look. Uh, so I make art. Uh, yeah, I make art and I play games. So I do play games on uh, both Twitch and YouTube. But uh, I want to I want to start focusing on my art. That'll make me quite happy. Yeah, you see, this isn't giving me the result that I want. And name like you'll see these. Because these shadows need to change. The color of this needs to change. So. I'm not even sure if that's acceptable. I'm going to use another render slot. And why, why we use render slots is mainly because. Uh, well. Render slots work like this. If. Really, if you render an image the time it takes to render that image, you already forgot what the previous image looks like. So it's important to have render uh, render slots like these so you can flip between. Always make use of render slots. I mean, it's hardly different. It's definitely changing the contrast, but I'm not happy with that. Uh, we really can't work with that. So... We really either need to get... I'm going to get some helper lamps in and we'll see if that works. So right now, we, I'm just going to make a, a small test. And we'll get to see. Yeah, so I'm just going to do a tiny test. Uh, I'm going to add in some points. I will 
I'm sure they all have the same settings. Uh, that. But uh, yeah, I, I do make art, but I'm making an anime, so. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, oh, you can do art for a follower, for money, we can pay. Yeah, yeah, I guess. I'm gonna figure out what's the best way to get paid. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I, I guess if someone wanted something, I... Damn it, where the hell is that light? <sighs> so difficult. Okay, there we go. I see that... That guy. You know what? Let's do this. Do I have points here somewhere? There we go. There we go. This. Right. We'll just select all of them at once. Uh, just pop them up. We'll see how these helpers work. If they aren't too good, then we'll walk away. If they are good, then we'll stick with them. For now... See. This is a really good track. One of my favorites. Make sure it's defuse only. I don't actually know how much energy we should give it, but let's see. So you see how that ends up brightening up the shadows? And that's exactly what I wanted. I think it's too much. So I will... I'll drop them just a little bit. Mm. Let's see. I think the best way is maybe puts when we can. Yeah, yeah, dude. I, I don't mind, man. I, I'm not I'm not rushing for the money. Yes, it'll make me pretty damn happy. But don't worry about it, man. We'll we'll get to it. Okay. I feel like it's super bright though. So what I, hmm, what I might do is, you know, we have that second area lamp. Like now, I wanna get rid of that, just to ensure that we are doing the right things here. I also want lights concentrated on one end of the classroom, because I noticed that uh, that's actually what happens. We do need to fix these shiny things. <laughs> But yeah, dude, whatever. Even, like, yeah, if you play games, Humble Bundle, that'll help. Uh, if you don't play games, then it doesn't matter. I'm also going to try this with a Hemi, but not now. I will try it with a Hemi, though. Because I really am curious to see what exactly I can do with that. If I can get, um, if I can get the shadows, because I know it's like, the shadows seem to have, like, a purple tint to them, maybe. I feel like it feels like a purple, dark purple tint. Okay. I think it's okay. Only thing we need to change now is like... I'll do point 0.4. Check that out.
also feel like line should go away the further ah, it's fine it's fine whatever mm. man this is such a damn good song mm. Try that. I'm gonna use a different render layer this time just to check. I mean, we're making progress. That's good. I do want to change. What I'm actually getting here is that the shadow. I'm mean, not the shadow. The specular that's hitting onto this desk is changing the color. Oh, geez, what ended up playing here? Ah. Let's go back there. Okay, so. I can definitely feel that that's what's happening here. Without a doubt. I'm pretty sure it's because of how the specularity is behaving here. Next, we need to fix this. Now, if we're sticking with the painted feel, then, yeah, we've got some things that we need to work on. Mm, yeah, so I might actually, I might scrap the, you know, like we did some lights here. I might scrap those and just leave lights over there. That that seems more logical because even like in this anime uh, reference that I'm using over here, I can see the light sort of, you know, gradients. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, now it's just a lot of fine tuning. We need to just really fine tune this. Yeah. Okay. What I do want to test out though is why did I say went through the hardness? Yeah. The hardness is ten. I'm gonna bump it up to twenty since twenty is half, and then we'll go back in, have a look, see what we've got. And if that doesn't work, I'll take it back to fifty. The original amount and then we'll see from there how that works like I said these desks still do need a mirror so that's also important all right I'll take us to 50 pop this into three so when I look at this you'll see we've, we're making steady progress and things are looking better already what's bugging me is this wall i really do want to work on that <clears throat> yeah you'll see we ended up getting some nice shadows here and that's good uh the ceiling looks quite decent i just need to adjust some stuff but that's uh that's going well uh, are you still with me keller my stream is actually pretty quiet today surprising Anyway, but I guess I don't have a lot of people to begin with. I don't think Julia's around. Uh, I don't know where she ended up. So yeah. Mm. Okay, but we are getting there. I do still feel like this needs to be thinner, just a tiny bit thinner. And this kind of feels like it's less saturated on these colors. Hmm, choices, choices, man. Anyway. Uh. Alright, so we'll do 50 on the third slot. So now you'll see when there's not so much white, we can tell how much the light's affecting stuff and how it's affecting stuff. The floor, I feel... Uh, needs to have like it does look like it has a warm specularity, but we'll have to see Only time will tell man only time will tell okay, so definitely That is not a result of Whatever's happening the I check this You'll see the hardness actually didn't do much Ah. Huh. Well, I'll put it back to 
what did I have it on? Like 10. And now I need to figure out what the hell we can do here. Because Devin, that's not even the color of the desk. You can see that. So I'm not too sure. Darker colors receive less light. So I might drop the value, but see how that ends up affecting it. It's close. Pretty damn close. Uh, I feel like our distribution is a bit out of whack because I see we don't have actual shading that we need. But so you're making your own anime? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, at least working on it. <laughs> working on making my own anime, yeah. Uh, yeah. So I'm going to do two types of renders because I do want to see. I want to see a kind of faked, painted uh, render and then a... Um, yeah, yeah, kind of a faked, faked, painted, and then kind of more stylized, whatever works really. So I don't even know how light's getting in there in all honesty, because that's all supposed to be dark. But anyway. I feel like we short that. I don't know. I'll, I'll see how the sun behaves when. But anyway. Now we kind of, yeah, we kind of are getting some of the color, but I'm not sure exactly what color this is. Hmm. That's like a richer red color. <sighs> Probably a little. I think the saturation is fine. I think it's a tiny, tiny bit. Try this. Otherwise, I'll just grab a color from. Because I think I have the actual reference image that I'm using, so I'll always just grab a color that works. Also, our biggest issue is not everything is colored. There's a lot of things that are still white, and that throws people off. I mean, if we don't have actual colors, it's we're not going to get the best effect. So I'm going to check how this looks rendered flat as well. I'm really not liking this. Checking something. I. What did I do? Oh. What does YouTube need to load now? Just refresh the damn music page. There we go. <laughs> uh, all right. You know what? I'm just gonna. Let me see if I can actually. And the results. Uh, this is not good. Mm. I actually get no. Okay, you know what? This is what I will do. I'll actually grab the. I got a cheer models anime reference, and there's one of them. There we go. We have some nice colors for us. And now, now what I'll do is I'll just grab a nice shadow here. And we'll work from there. Let's check this out. I feel like it's, <clears throat> like it's okay. I think. We already got the lines, okay. Hmm. Choices, choices, man. 
Oh, we actually need lights as well. Totally forgot to model those. Hmm. This color isn't perfect. I don't know why. I just want to check if I just want to see something. We have really intense specular. Let's see, we aren't getting. Yeah, we are. We are, we're getting exactly what happens. Okay, I'll keep it low for now. Right. So. All right. So it's not the specularity that's doing that. I mean, the color is close though. I think what's important is if we have a reflection that might also behave well. Hmm. I'm amazed that there aren't shadows inside the desks. It makes no sense to me. Because how? How is it that there's no shadows in the desks? That makes really, really makes no sense to me. Hmm. Uh, anyway, so we are going to need to adjust these, I feel, definitely. Mm. So what I'm going to test quickly is, I think we'll just shade this guy flat. Shade it flat and give it a look. I mean, it behaves okay. It definitely behaves better, but is that a line? Yeah, looks like it. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. This is quite interesting. So I need to really just nail this shading. I don't even know how this is working because like it's not happening there. So I don't actually know what's happening there. <laughs> okay. Mm. I think it's okay. This isn't the color that I want in all honesty. I think we need either more saturation or or maybe darker. But I know, I think if we, you know what? I think if we lower the intensity that this has, we should be able to get the color that we want. Hmm. Wonder if I can actually, let me eye drop. Maybe one of these colors. Hmm. Yes, like diffuse shadow should be something around here, I think. I'm thinking that's gonna be the color. Let's see. It's close. but not damn close enough. <laughs> hmm. I really hope that was going to be correct, but it's not. I do feel we need more saturation in this. Too much. <laughs> Jeez, colors, man. 
Especially when you're working with 3D color, that's really where you start getting the actual issues in life. What the hell's happening there? I don't have a mirror on, do I? No. What's happening there? Okay, I think the saturation is fine. Now it's just the tone of the color that needs to change. I think everything's fine. Now it's just really the tone. Come on, baby. It's close. Pretty damn close. This is a pity we have to wait for the render. I could never do this. Why? Why couldn't you? You can do anything, man. You can do anything as long as your hands work. At least that's what I think. <laughs> I think I might actually just skip the bevel altogether and just do a flat wall. Like I've I've seen flat walls work. Uh, well, that's it's looking good. It's pretty close, but there's no reflection, and that's part of our problem. Yeah. Now what's important is this guy. So I'm going to. Do something like that. Have a look at that. Might need to drop the spe uh, specular reflection a little bit, but let's see. It's about 13. Let's do this along with it. Let's make it 10. I'm gonna check this. definitely a lot more than I want it to be uh, it's a lot of work and I'm not very good at art uh, hey you can be good if you want to be good that that's one part of uh, of the equation there I drop this to about half we'll check how half behaves if if it's still a problem we'll just change some of the color there Turn about 250. And we'll do the same here. Definitely, I think that's about right. I'm not really sure about the hardness. It's definitely going to be a shadow, like, oh, not a shadow, a. Thing like that seems like the color is a lot warmer though instead of just white hmm. yeah because if I look at this I just want to double check this if I put this back to 50 sharper highlight and then we double check Ah, oh, damn it, I should have actually done that on a different layer. Uh, oh. Uh, damn it. Okay. You see, there's a lot of testing. We've got to test quite a bunch of stuff. But it's because I've never really made um, a lot of, like, this type of stylized work before. So, that's that's the real issue here. There's definitely behavior with that, so go back into slot two. Yeah, you can see we're a lot a lot better now. At least that's how I feel. I might keep this for reference though. Mm, let's go back to tens. What 
wonder if Seb is alive. There he is. So definitely I can see what the hardness achieves. Stretch is pretty far though. And to me it looks like the actual it's either, the specularity is warm. I'm pretty sure it's it's not white, it's warmer. Hmm. But yeah, I mean um Keller, it actually keeps uh, keeps me busy. Uh, it's nice to have projects. That's how you improve yourself. If you have projects that you can keep working on and better yourself, that's how you'll improve. Okay, given what I'm looking at, like I said, these lines are still a bit too harsh, but <clears throat> we'll work on that. Now, the actual problem comes in. I'm, I think freestyle is actually doing something wonky. Uh, hmm. Should actually give it a texture, but anyway. Uh, thickness. So, you'll notice that it has like a thickness whatever but i'm feeling like it's doing the opposite of what i wanted to do so i'm going to invert this let's use another layer because this was a test layer anyway now let's check this freestyle because somehow i feel like it's using one camera as a reference point and I think it's that camera B. Am I correct though? No. I'm not correct. <laughs> okay. Makes sense. Okay. No, it's fine. So we'll keep that the way it was. Mm. Okay, anyway. Oh. That was the line. Okay. Hmm. Damn it. Uh that's so that's a <clears throat> a lower hardness, right? And so we just need to figure out how hard this needs to be. And when I look at this This is going all the way till here. We need to go, like, stop somewhere here at the halfway. So, maybe half of what we are working with. Mm, let's do 100. 125. That's not what I was trying to do. Uh, 0.125. There we go. Right on this guy. No, wait. So it's the hardness. Okay, okay, hang on. Hang on. I'm making mistakes here. Okay. So, if that's the case, that means something like 20 would be good. And in fact, you know, if I leave one, I'll be able to reference exactly what's happening. So now you'll see one of them is lower which I think is this one it's a line shop we'll be able to see like clearly mm. that's a nice way of looking at yeah yeah dude that's that's how you get stuff done man so 20 is too much without a doubt if I go go we'll go somewhere in between let's do 15 Check it now. Let's drop it on another slot. Mm. 
Huh. <clears throat> this is quite interesting. So, looking at this, at least from my perspective, uh, yeah, maybe 15. Yeah, 15 it is. Let's do 15. There we go. I think that's about enough. Really not sure. It looks like it's about enough. Now let's do the mirror. I'm worried about the mirror though because... Try this now. We're gonna try the mirror. Damn it. I think I had this in like thirty samples. Let's check. You see what happens when we have the reflections going. This is what I was worried about, like, freezing. So now you'll see... What happens. Now the amount of reflection, I think, is okay. What's important is the blurriness now. Also, the fact that I believe it only should be on the table and not on the chairs. Hmm. To me, it looks like the reflections are actually like also like a warm color. I'm gonna actually just take this color and just warm it up on the reflection. Actually, let's do that. So, the amount of reflection, I'm not sure if that's too much, but we'll see. So, for now, I'm just gonna grab this color. Up this guy here. Okay. Right, go here and we'll desaturate this guy. Quite a bit. No, no. Actually, we're not desaturating. We're making it lighter. That's the guy. And then we'll desaturate it. But to me, it looks something like... Heck, I can just grab it from my... And let's actually do that. It's something like this color. Okay. Let's check this out now. Come on, baby. Work with me. I might need to make it a little lighter because the darkness of this affects how much reflection actually gets cast off. Mm. Let's see. In messages. these messages ah. <sighs> I 
Damn it, man. Okay, one second. I'm just responding to something. Sorry about this. Fucking... Okay. All right, sorry about that. All right, anyway, back to what we were doing. I think this is looking damn good, man. Wow. Holy shit, look at that. That's exactly what I was going for. I think it might be just a tad bit too warm. Uh, so I might actually just bump that value up just a little bit more. To get it slightly closer to white. Heck, I might actually take the same color reflections and drop them onto the floor. Because that seems to be the actual answer here. It's getting uh, a reflection to behave that way. I just want to... Make sure I test this out because... Okay, come on. I think we might need to blow it just a little more as well. But it's looking damn good, so... Was it six? Where were we at? Four? Yeah, I guess we're done with this step, so it's fine. Uh, okay, let's see. So when do you think the anime will be done? <laughs> I have no idea. I mean, I'm almost done with the classroom. Once I'm, It's a lot of copy-paste after that, you know. Um, but once I'm done with the, the classroom, it's we're moving to the hallway. Uh, from the hallway, I might do uh, some of the stairs, the entrance. Uh, if there's any other rooms that we need but that's not a big deal because even if i need to mock that up quickly i can um the outside of the school that's going to be super challenging that's going to be mm, that's going to be so damn hard <laughs> and once that's done i have to finish the characters and then then we'll start actual production on the anime so yeah man it can get a bit crazy hmm So yeah, this is render slot five. Close the edge. Five. Okay. Now I don't know what value I had this set on. So I might just no, one second. I just re take this color again right, so that's the exact color and what I want to do is render this guy in um, slot 5 here so but I mean hey you guys get to watch like you guys get to watch me make the entirety of this anime so <laughs> does it really matter <laughs> I already see it here where the reflection is strong. There we go. So that's this color. <clears throat> the exact color. And what I want to see now is 
slot 3, I think it is. Okay, standard freestyle slot 3. Hmm. Slot 3 is definitely stronger. Slot 5. Hmm. The 5 looks about right, I think. Yeah. That's slot 5. I think I think slot 5 is good. Okay. We are getting places now, boys. I'm not sure if I'm going to put a texture on the desk or not, but we'll get to that. Because uh, last time I did a texture, it looked pretty damn sweet. I really think there is a, a light texture on the disc. I think it's the same texture as the uh, floors, but just lighter. I might actually do that. Heck, we might as well. Uh, we know what will happen. Uh... Well, no. So, you guys aren't going to see the voice acting. You guys are going to see some of the animation because it's going to be way too much work and a lot of other people are going to be doing parts of the animation. So, um, so yeah, I don't think you guys will know what happens. Um, because, yeah, you won't be able to tell, really. Um. So now, let's just remember that this reflectivity is at 137, okay? 137, so I'm gonna go to slot six. I'll bump this up to about like, like way higher and check that out. Just cause I wanna see how much reflection we need to actually uh, get the perfect result. Uh, okay, so now I get to look at this and let's see. Actually, I think now it looks better than it did. Actually, it looks a lot closer. Okay, hang on. That's slot six, five. It's definitely... I know the chairs aren't supposed to actually have any shadow, but I mean any reflection like this, but huh. Five makes it look pretty damn good, but then it's these ones that end up looking like overly gloss. Hmm. Seven. Okay. I'm gonna lower the gloss amount like quite a bit and then we'll see. From, from here, what the actual... Um, do you work with a big company? Uh, no. <laughs> no, I don't. I, mean, I have my own company, but um, no, I don't work with a huge company, no. Uh, just a bunch of buds that are getting together to make this project happen. Seven and six. So that's a lot like we've got more blur on it now. Uh, five. That's no. Okay, so this was the light. We've already passed this. Five. Six. And then seven. I think seven is our guy. Yep. 
Yeah, definitely. Seven is our guy. That's just what I feel. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it gives us the right amount of stuff. Yeah. Okay. So, that's looking good. Seven. Uh, I'm not sure if this reflection is as a result of the, the blurring and we might have to increase our samples. Oh, you're going to sleep, Keller? Okay, have a good night, man. Hope you enjoyed watching my stream. Will I do one tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah, well. I'm not sure if we need ambient occlusion, in all honesty. I might want to try the ambient occlusion. That's going to take forever to load. Okay. Prep yourselves, boys. It might lag. Holy shit, is that... Ah, okay, so that's what the ambient occlusion does. <laughs> to be honest, the desks look a lot better, but that's the only thing that looks better. <laughs> Even the... Why, though? That is so... Like, why did the shading change? Huh. Interesting stuff. Just prep to lag. Like, the, the music might actually lag out, so... Jeez, ambient occlusion seems to do something. I just don't know what. <laughs> I just need to check. I think it is making it brighter though, so we'll have to just check the factor on that ambient occlusion. Okay, seven's our guy. It does certainly brighten things up. But is it by a lot? It's making certain lights <clears throat> do certain things. You'll try to be there. Okay, thanks, buddy. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. I hope you had a good time. I can definitely see more here on six, though. Hmm. And we have quite a bit of samples on this as well. <clears throat> it's looking good. It's definitely looking good. I feel like we need specular color to have some warmth in it as well. Because I definitely don't feel like it's white. It might be white. I don't know. Hmm. But I think this is looking damn good, if you ask me. <laughs> okay, so another thing that I want to try on 
uh, slot 7. Oh, slot 8. Is. And this is why we use slots, you know, we can always, uh, you know, move forward, move back to see if things are looking well. So now what I'm going to do here, damn it. Oh, for God's sake. Okay. Mm. Okay, so what I want to do here is I want to turn these off. These three. Now they aren't evenly placed. We really place them like randomly. But I do want to check if we could get half the room to behave a certain way. Man, I love this song. Out. Yeah, so I was right. We, we did get it to do what we wanted it to. What's bugging me now, though? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, what's bugging me now? <clears throat> is the fact that we aren't getting all of this on the like on the walls like I know that the walls are getting affected by a different light but we might not even need that to happen anymore hmm I wonder <clears throat> Cause like even the desks, like they didn't change much. I really like what it's doing with the ceiling as well. But these shadows might be too dark and that's why the need for a Hemi. Because then we can get the Hemi shadow to behave a certain way. <clears throat> hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I'm really liking this. I just don't know. Okay. One more. What we'll do instead is I'm going to take I kind of want to listen to that song again. <laughs> I really, really like this song. Wow. Okay. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to try to get rid of this light group. And we already know what light group it is, right? So, now I want to see. So I've seen some darkness go in there, but I'm not sure if you see even how this wall is working. But it's working that way because <clears throat> of the lights that were there. And when whereas these walls actually need to be dark. So you can definitely tell how it's shifted the way the light behaves. Hmm. 
Nah. Okay, it's fine. We'll stick with this, but... <clears throat> the only problem is that's bugging me. Like, quite a bit. Because that's... It's supposed to look like that, but it's not. And I think it's because of the light. Um, I think it's because the light over here isn't actually on the exact top. As long as it's not, like, behind, it's fine. Okay, so, <clears throat> we've established that I think these lights are actually quite necessary. Uh, although, like I said, we could actually just, like, achieve that with a Hemi. But what I will do is, we'll, we'll put this onto another layer and then test. Ah. And I worked out yesterday, my arms and my body is so damn so man it's already been two hours jeez time flies man way to actually do this so I know we've we've probably fixed that light over there but yeah I am gonna test this with a hemi and see but right now what I want to do is this uh, where is this area lamp this our guy I'm noticing this guy is quite a lot brighter because of the distance I'm gonna put this on like half. Let's do like 12. Kind of check that out. I think we're on slot 8. Yeah. Because <clears throat> I really want. I want it to affect it just a tiny bit. Which again, we could have just affected all of that just with the Hemi. And the lights in the room. I also feel like this, uh, these walls here aren't getting enough of the exposure. They're supposed to get hit, like, really hard. And it might be just because of the specularity. I don't know. Uh, I might actually just, you know, from here, I think I can check. Once it's done with the rendering. But first, let's just see. Yeah, you see seven. It's pretty bright. And we don't want that really uh we want this to be pretty dark like this is getting all the light that it needs but these two need to be quite dark <clears throat> and also that purple there's this purple color that's in there like mixed in purple and blue uh, i might just color pick them just to see what exact colors they are but we get in there man this is looking pretty damn good um, now I need to think about how we're going to do this chalkboard, but I will do it with like a cloud texture as well because we can and then just have the shading be affected by that. I think that could actually work quite well. Um, now it's fair to say we don't actually have shadows. <laughs> so that is another thing that is troubling. We don't have any cast shadows, uh, which we need. So... We'll have to see. We'll have to see how we get that to work. Uh. Hmm. Choices, choices, man. Next song, damn it. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so seven versus eight. Yeah, it's we we definitely need this guy to be darker. So I might just do really light. 
echo that works. <clears throat> Now I suddenly feel like, well, I don't know, let's see, let's see. I mean, it's about right, I feel. Hmm. As long as we just keep comparing to the original. That's pretty wonky though, like... I'm changing the color of the area lamp. That is affecting those things. Oh, I think it's affecting everything. Maybe. I don't know. I have no idea. If I disable it, that, that might be able to tell us some things. But you can clearly see. I don't know if it's just because the background has become lighter. But I can definitely tell that the floor as well. Maybe it's the bounce light. Yeah, because that's pretty unnatural. And this looks more correct in terms of what's supposed to be happening. Uh, hmm. <clears throat> I think we could also use the main set of lights that illuminate this section. Uh, you see, there's a lot of like this, like working on stuff like this. Mm. Let's actually check this out. So, I'm gonna go to material. I don't know why that thing's colored that way, but whatever. <laughs> uh, I'm really liking our... Yeah, this is actually looking quite good. Though my only issue is that because this is specular, you'll notice that we get it from only where the camera is. Like if it, it will never actually... Or maybe, I, I don't know. You see, when I move around, the specularity moves around with me. She's not actually supposed to do that. So we'll have to figure it out. See what we can do there. <clears throat> anyway. So next is this table. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take... Uh, hopefully. Hopefully I can get this. Nah, I think it, I think it picked like directly. There we go. So now I just need to have a look at this. Yeah, I do kind of feel like there's more yellow involved in the lights, <clears throat> like the way the lights are working. I do feel like even like the sun needs to be a lot brighter and we'll work on it. And we need to actually fix this. <laughs> hmm. Alright, well, let's check this out. This is okay. We need to be more desaturated. Yeah, I think that's the guy. And then... It's also got this, like, reflection, so I might do the same thing. Let's check. If it's not the reflection, we'll cheat it with something else.
Let's drop this. Ooh. Yeah, this is what I was worried about. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, so what happens when you render reflections, man. It gets a bit wild. Okay. Now, it's not what I want. That's without a doubt. That is not what I'm looking for. But... Uh, what I do want to check, though, is... Value up. Desaturate the guy. Yeah, gotta desaturate that dude. Okay, just prepare for another one. Uh, it might actually freeze again, but we're gonna look at this just quickly. That really isn't what we're looking for. I hope everything. I hope everything didn't freeze. <laughs> okay. I hope everything didn't freeze there. But, uh, yeah, you see, so reflection isn't always the answer. We need to kind of figure this. So what I might do, I might do a ramp. And I might... I think we still have this, but it's fine. So what I might do... I don't know if we should actually just do that in the specular. Eh, let's try this, though. So now, I'll take this guy, move this dude here. Uh, <clears throat> that, get this guy over here, wherever we need it, and then it's just this dude. So, same thing, we just grab that. No alpha. And then, all we have to do now is make this guy kind of desaturated and kind of lighter. There we go. Now I hope that works. Mm. Come on, work with me. Because I'm not actually seeing this. <clears throat> Come on, damn it. Okay, there we go. Uh, no. Okay, let's do this with like a really stupid color. So I'm going to take this guy, copy that, and then we will use like a blue to actually see. What the hell is going on here? And no, that's not what we want. We want, uh, where is the input energy? That a thing? Nope. Uh, normal. <laughs> huh. I'm assuming that the normal works from the direction that we look at it. That is actually quite interesting. In fact, I could use that for something. Uh, heck, I could have just simulated the reflections by using this, in all honesty. Huh. I'm actually, I'll try that off stream. But anyway, <laughs> that's not what we were looking for. Uh, okay, I know what result does. I know what normal does. Energy. That's probably just where the light is coming from. Uh, is there any way that we can get this to work the way I want it to work? Hmm. I'm not 
sure. Unless we use the specularity, but nah, that's not gonna work either. Hmm. Okay, maybe a ramp isn't the answer. Can I actually get like a gradient blend? There we go. Ah. Uh, Alright. For now, I just want to test to see if multiplayer will work. Uh. Holy shit. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, okay, now obviously we can't see textures. I don't think we can even if we are in texture mode for some reason. Because that's just the way life works. Um, so what I do want to see is... If I hit... Rendered. Okay, prep yourselves, boys. It's gonna make a lot of noise. Okay, there. It's fine. I'm not liking this, though. Oh, projection. No. Generated. That's it. Okay. Anyway, anyway. You know what? I think... Uh, let's let's just do this. I think I'm just gonna do like one render. Okay, and then holy shit, what did I end up doing? Uh, Cause, huh? Where the hell is the? Oh my god! Don't screw with me. What? Where the hell is the chalkboard? Uh. What? Okay, well, I ended up like deleting a chalkboard. Um. We'll just do this. There we go. That works. Okay. Well, how the hell we ended up deleting that chalkboard? Alright. Alright, I think it's okay. Alright. Anyway. I just want to make sure that this isn't doing that. Okay. Well, that's that. I'm gonna render this. Let's see. So we can look at our progress. Ugh. Now that the light's not here, I'm not sure if that even affected like... It affected the desks, definitely. But I didn't have it. Oh my god, that's so weird. That's definitely caused an issue now because... That light was important. <laughs> hmm. Although I think we could get the same result from using the... Uh, what the hell? I think we can get the same result from using uh, those um, floaty lights that we have. Maybe. Hmm. That is so wonky. And I'm not sure if it's... Ah. Okay, well, well, we'll figure it out. Don't worry about that. We'll get to it. Anyway, I think that's it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. It was a lot of fun. You can see we're actually making some pretty damn decent progress on this... Uh... Once we color everything, things should start like making sense for the most part. Um, yeah, I think we'll definitely, uh, maybe I'll just get rid of like the ambient occlusion or something so that we can 
render peacefully. Uh, but we're looking good, like, we've got highlights and there's a lot of cool things happening here, so I think I'm quite happy. Anyway, thanks so much for, uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. Make sure you guys check out my Discord. Make sure you guys check out my social media. If you guys want to support my stream, check out Humble Bundle. You guys get to buy games, donate to me, and donate to charity at the same time. And yeah, I think that's going to be it for me. I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, actually, because it's, it's really late. I really need to start streaming early, and I will, I will stream early tomorrow. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.